Hey folks, hope you're doing well today. This is my first video post Hobby Palooza. Uh, my appreciation to uh, Mike, baseball collector, for having me on the show with him and Josh, rated rookie, had a great time on Sunday. If you haven't seen that, go check out his channel and watch that video. Uh, just want to show some pickups that I've made the past couple of weeks. And this isn't everything I've gotten. I've actually got a couple of golden auction pickups, but I decided to do that in a separate video that I'll probably show Friday uh, because I want to talk about the importance of due diligence uh, in uh, using one of the things I purchased as an example because I did some due diligence and it worked out for me. But I'm going to start off here with a 2021 Topps Cabrian Hayes Rookie Super Short Print. This is one, he's sort of fallen off in the past month or so. I think long-term, I've said this before, I think he'll be fine. I think he'll have a good career, especially if he gets out of Pittsburgh. But uh, this is one I'm just going to throw in the box, and fingers crossed. I don't do a ton of speculation, um, not high-end speculation anyways, but uh, this is one I'm just going to throw in the box, and hopefully in the next couple of years it'll be several times what I paid for it. If not, then no big deal. It's part of the game. You take the wins with the losses. Uh... Next was a lot from a guy on the blowout forums. A little disappointed because of the condition of some of the cards. They came in super nasty cases. And uh, one of the cases damaged probably the best card in here. So, But it's it's mostly Pedro Martinez and Roger Clemens. So I'm going to jump right into it. We'll start off here with this, this Donruss uh, Signature Series, Pedro Martinez. Interesting that he didn't sign where he was supposed to. He signed right there. But I like it. I'll hold on to it for a bit. This will go on the PC. Good, good pitcher. Good closer. Uh, next here we got some, it's a game-worn shoe. I don't think that's numbered. That is not numbered. A triple threads with a nice Mets patch, but I don't think of him as a Met. So, uh, you know, I love a nice patch, but I, I like I like the patch to be of a team that I, I like to think of the player as having been with. Um, so I will sell this. I will get rid of most of these. I'll probably just keep one of each that you'll see at the end. Got this dual jersey swatch Expos Red Sox. Just a very plain swatch. This uh, piece of game used cap. And I don't know what that is, if that's dirt or what. But it's numbered out of 125. It's out of Upper Deck Vintage. A little two-color patch here. Nice little thing. Numbered out of 125. Another two-colored patch. This one is numbered out of 325. This Crowning Glory Game Worn Cap, uh, numbered out of 25, out of Upper Deck Vintage. This is Essentials 2003 Fleer's little jersey swatch. Not, I don't think it's numbered. It's not numbered. And then, I'll talk about this one in a second. This, uh, a nice little Manny Ramirez Pedro Red Sox patch. Patches numbered out of 50, has some damage right there, which I I thought it might. The pictures weren't super clear, but I, it did look like there was something on the edge right there. Uh, so I assume that there was probably something going on. This card, which is a great looking card, Ultimate, Ultimate Collection had some great patches. But again, I just don't think of Pedro Martinez as a Met. So I will sell this one. It's numbered out of, what was it numbered out of? 25? Yeah, 25 right there. Uh, Great looking patch, just not in the right uniform. This card is the one that was damaged. So I said these came in some really crappy cases. Uh, this was the case that this came in. And when I unscrewed it, pulled it off, you kind of can see it. There's some dots. I can't really see it. Oh, yeah, I can. Right there, you see those dots? And there's some down here. Well, the card was stuck to the case. And so when I pulled it off, it pulled off parts of the card. So I emailed the buyer. I didn't ask for a partial refund or anything. I just said, hey, just FYI, because I had seen that he had put some of the cards that he had for sale in the forum on eBay. He said, you might want to take some of the, take these cards out of the cases just to make sure they're not damaged because this happened to this Roger Clemens. Um, I was torn when I got these because, I, like I said, I just wanted to keep one nice patch of each player. And that was a really nice patch, but I don't think of him, of Roger Clemens, as an Astro. I think of him as a Red Sox, Red Sox, Red Sox, and a Yankee. Uh, and this next card had a nice uh, Red Sox patch and Yankees patch, which is great, but I didn't care for the, the opposing side thing, the you know, different side, front and back side thing. Um, so I was like, well, do I, do I want to keep this one or would I want to keep this one? And then that happened and I, I made up my mind for me. I said, okay, I'm keeping this one. But um, 
I don't know what this would have gone for on eBay before that, probably 50 to 75, somewhere in that range. Now it's probably like a $25 card. Not a huge loss, but annoying nonetheless. And then the last card was Pedro Martinez and uh, has Red Sox and Expos and then the hierarchy of teams that Pedro, that I like for uh, to think of as Pedro Martinez haven't played on. For me, it's Red Sox, then Expos uh, with Mets down at the bottom. But nice little dual patch piece there. We got a dual patch Clemens here. Not my favorite pickup, so my favorite pickup is this one. It is a signed 300th, 300th win ticket uh, from Nolan Ryan's 300th game win game that he pitched on July 31st, 1990. Uh, notated with 300 wins, authenticated by PSA DNA. Let's see if I can pull it out here just a little. Yeah, you get the idea. But what makes this more special to me, Nolan Ryan, my favorite player. What makes this even more special to me, though, is that he won that game on my eighth birthday. So, And oddly enough, he pitched his last game on my sister's birthday a few years later. So my little, uh, we have a little association. Our birthdays have a little association with Nolan Ryan. I like that. But yeah, signed ticket from his 300th win game. PSA DNA authenticated. I like it. I like most of these patches, but I'm only keeping one of each. And then uh, I got the Cabrian Hayes, super short print, which I think I mixed in here. No, it's right here. So let me know if you had a favorite. Uh, next video is coming up. I got my golden auction wins, just two, two little lots, several cards, but two little lots. I've got two cards coming back from PSA, two coming back from SGC. So I'll probably lump those into a video um, and maybe do a little, I don't know, blaster box break, I don't know. But anyways, let me know if you had a favorite. Till next time, as always, have a great day. Bye.